here. Let me be great. Let me be great. Yo, yo, who is the man? Who is the man? I am the man. I'm the boss. Wagwan, <laughs> choking great peeps. Was good. And it's a boy choking great checking in, man. As you can see, man, it's raining, man. I'm over here in Joplin, misery. Yep. I'm heading to the CFI Joplin terminal. The CFI is main terminal right now. I'm waiting there to go pick up my load. I got this patch on a load that's going to it's going to Illinois. That delivers at seven o'clock in the morning. You feel me? So yeah, that load that came from home from, from Florida. I dropped that load off this morning because that was a Japanook load. But um I got a little hell up over there because there was no empty trailer at that yard that I uh, dropped it off at. So they they let me bobtail over here. It's 150 miles away from Arkansas. So that I can pick up this load. You understand? And that's what I like with CFI, man. They, because, as I said before um, in my previous video, it's kind of difficult for them to find a load that picks up today and will drop off tomorrow. It's hard to find a load like that. You understand? Because, um, most people don't don't um they don't they don't broker the loads like that you feel me they broker the loads with with some with some time to spare they give you like a day or two to make a job you understand yeah so cfi is the main terminal so they have some some related loads sitting there at the yard so they say all right come pick up one of these loads and deliver it so that's what I'm on my way to go do right now, man. But it's raining, man. They say there's even snow in the forecast right now. Uh, there's, it's 33 degrees right now where I'm at, man. I'm cold. You feel me? Yeah. <laughs> I am cold. You feel me? I'm cold, man. Yeah. I haven't been to Joplin in a while, man. I haven't, I haven't been over here to this terminal in over... Let me see. I think... About two to three months. Yeah. I haven't been here in a while. You understand? So, yeah. I'm going to get my truck washed here and everything. And I'm going to see if I can get some footage for y'all of after the, after the, after the NTR terminal. For y'all guys to see how it's, how it's, what it's like. You understand? Yeah. Traffic here in Japan is always... Always crazy, man. You feel me? Yeah. And it's always flipping cold over here in Joplin. Always cold. I don't know why it's always cold, man, but it is. Always flipping cold. When I came here in January, it was flipping snowing. Yeah, that's when I came in January. It was snowing, man. And they say that there's snow in the forecast here. Again. So. I have not. Captured any footage of the snow. For you guys yet. Um, that's why I wanted the drone. You understand? And. To be honest. I went to. I went to Best Buy today. To see if I could get a drone. And they didn't have the drone that I want. I wanted the DJI Mavic. I wanted the the one that had uh, the three batteries on it, the mini. I'm, one, I'm trying to figure out what they call it again. Yeah, what is the one that had the, the three batteries on it? You feel me? That's the one I wanted to get, and they, they said they didn't have it. You feel me? So that was a little bit disappointing. Yeah. Man. But I'm on my way to CFI, guys, so you just stay tuned as I pull up to the terminal, you feel me? 
Big Bad CFI. Yeah. See if I can give the guys a good tour. You see me? Yeah. Joplin misery. And I hate when the weather is like this. But this is what it is. This is CFI. Alright, so pull up to the gate. Open sesame. Up my feet, bad man. <laughs> yeah, man, but uh, from all this time that I've been to CFI, man, I, I really don't have much bad things to say about the company, honestly. Yeah, there's, yeah, there's really nothing bad to say about it. You feel me? There really isn't. You yeah, understand? Especially now that um for art, expect art. What I did for me today, right? They went to the little way to find me a load, so that I wouldn't have to sit. You understand? They to find me a specific load that I can deliver tomorrow. You understand? To go on my paycheck. You feel because y'all know I'm just coming off of home time. You understand? Just coming off of home time, so I only had enough time in the week to do one load, which is load I dropped off this morning. You feel me? So uh, let me show you guys the terminal because that's what I should be showing you all anyways. You feel me? So they phoned me this load, they let me come to the terminal and relay me, understand? That I own operator right there. And this right here is the main dispatch building. And the main building is over there. That building is where we have orientation and everything. Yes, and this is the dispatch building right here. Oh, it's raining, so let me park somewhere. Let me see if I can get close. I ain't gonna be any closer than this. Oh. Uh, park in the bobtail spot. So yeah, guys, I went to the way to find me a load. Just I wouldn't, have, I wouldn't have to sit and do nothing. You know? So I waste the rest of my day because I had five hours left on my clock. And I said I drove six hours this morning, and I had five hours left, and I just drove two hours to get here. Yes, then so I have three hours left for the day. I'm gonna decide if I'm gonna run. I'm, I'm gonna find out what what the delivery window on this load. To see if I can just sit, sit the rest of the night and run in the morning. You feel me, so yeah, let's go inside. I need my my ID to get in there. Yep. So it's raining. Oh, I need my mask too. So yeah, not quite ready yet. Alright. I like this mask. Yeah, this mask is dope. Come on, dog. Oh. ID ready? Let's go. Oh, I got to go in the rain. Let's run, guys. Let's run. Run, 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 run. You have his call. Oh, God. It is call. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> I'll take some from here right now. <laughs> yeah, four nine eight seven two. Hey, I brought you on load, buddy. 
Yeah. Yes, sir. Definitely. Yeah, that's what I realized. Man, I'm so happy. Yeah, perfect. That that'll be good for me. Okay, thank you. I appreciate it, man. I've I've been. I know it's hard to get the next day load. So. I know it's difficult to get the next day load. So. Trust. Me. Yeah. 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 Just coming from home time, so I appreciate that. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> uh, is it gonna snow today? Cause that's how I like. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay, perfect, sir. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right. Here you go, guys. All right. I'm good. How are you? This my C5 is the best. Check it out. Yeah, CFI. What they got in here? All you know that. Yeah, the snacks and stuff. See, this is what they get in the main terminal. You see me? And of course, no smoking in here. Come over here. And for the soda it's yeah. in there is safety department. So that's where we went and we when you do your upgrade test, that's where you go. And you take your test and all that. See equipment, you can make some coffee for free if you want. And all that. You see me? Ice machine. Yeah. Cool. CFI. Of course, most of these places are probably closed because of the COVID. You feel me? Oh, yeah. CFI training. For those who want CFI information, there you go. Here you go. Everything is here, but this is the main terminal. You see, they teach you how to put a train for snow time. It's snow time now, so they teach you to put a train on the tires. Now, of course, this is a super single tire, so it's a big one. These are equipments they used to have in the truck for safety, just to make your life easier. Flashlight and stuff like that. You feel me? Yeah. All that stuff. What's oh, back here? These are bunk room if you want to relax. And we got a washer. There's two laundry room. There's two laundry room, guys. Of course, free, free stuff. Look, they provide soap for you. Ah, that. There's two one over here. There's another one over here. You see me? Same thing. Same setup, because this is main terminal, I guess they got more stuff. And of course, more shoes are here for the female, for the male. There's your boy chucking grade right there. Of course, shower. 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 No exit, I don't know what's about there, so. I'm gonna take you guys down to the gym. Yeah, let's go down to the gym. See, oh, this is the bedroom tires. They put your put the chain on the bedroom tires right here. Look at that. Look at 
that. It's good, man. Fire lounge. This is a lounge here. This is another one. Right here. So, down to the gym. I think the gym is probably closed though with us of the COVID. So, yeah. No smoking. Fitness center. Employees only. So, if you're not a CFI employee, you can get in here. See? If you don't have one of this, you can get in here. So you want to play basketball and stuff? Lice horn. Princess of me. You guys want to see me shoot some hoops? Huh? You want to see me shoot some hoops all by myself? Hold on. Got music. And got to wait. Oh, he's open back. Look at all these guys. Look at this. Yeah. You got to wait. Lots and lots of weights. So... I have no excuse to be fat, right? And of course, I got the restrooms behind here, the terminal. So, oh, this is another part of it. I think I'm getting lost. It's another part of it. Oh, no, I'm not. See, main restroom, the female one right there. So let's check out the male restroom. Look at this. Look how big this thing is. Chucking great. Look at that. We got lots and lots of showers. You see me? Yep. Lockers to store your stuff when you're going to work out. So, yeah. Everything is here. Don't mind. So, right there. So, let's see much I weigh. <laughs> I'm not, I ain't gonna lie. So, let's see much I weigh. Put it up. 150. What the hell? So, I weigh 180. No. What the hell? Are we up for 180? So we about 1. You see? So that's. So we about 1. It's a 150 here. And it's just below 34 there. So about 183 and a half. God damn. Damn. Chucking good is fat. Yeah, my fat man. So let's see. I'm gonna make this video go to 20 minutes. So let's see if I can make a tree pointer. You guys think I can make a tree pointer? Huh? You guys think I can make a tree pointer shoot? Let's see. Let's see if I can make a tree pointer. There's a ball on here. Y'all think I can do it? Huh? I think I can do it. Let's see. Oh, shit! <laughs> oh, I missed. Oh. oh, man, no! I almost did. I didn't make it, but what do you guys think about the farm? One more try. God damn, man. Why am I missing? Huh? I can't make a three pointer. God damn. Third. 
Oh! That was almost in there. That was always in there. Let me do a layup. I'm the best. All right, guys. I'm dying. I'm tired. Catch you guys later. All right. All right, so people, I'm not leaving here until I make a tree pint. Short. All right. And then I'm going to get my truck washed. You guys see why CFI is good, right? You hear that guy? Straight from his mode. This is mode. You feel me? They didn't have anything. You feel me? A load got rescheduled, and I'm here, and they just give it to me. You feel me? They didn't have to. You understand? They could have sent me a regular load, a thousand mile load, or whatever, that delivers on Thursday, or whatever. You feel me? So, man, I'm grateful, man. I don't want to be unbiased. I'm biased. What is it? I don't want to be biased because I really haven't not worked for any other company. So, I don't have any other company. So, compare CFI too. You feel me? But, so far, so good, man. I've been here over 10 months now. And life's good. <laughs> so, watch me make a tree pointer, man. I don't know. You guys think I can make it? Yeah, here goes nothing. Yeah, here goes nothing. God damn! Where am I missing? This truck is not going to get washed today if I don't make the street find it. So, I gotta show the tree. Come on! Come on, TG! Come on, you got it, you got it! You got it! You got it, what? Oh! Almost there! Almost, come on! You're from Jamaica, boy! You can do anything! You can do anything, you're from Jamaica! Oh, shit! <laughs> that was almost cool. That was almost cool. All right, let's see. Here we go again. Here we go again. <laughs> Man. Well, this don't want to be... This, this ball just doesn't like me. I feel it's a ball. Right? Not my fault. It's a ball. The ball doesn't want to go in there. Let's see. Y'all see that? Y'all see that it's a bar, right? It ain't me. Damn. Let me be great. Let me be great. <laughs> yo, yo. Who is the man? Who is the man? I am the man. I'm the boss. All right. <laughs> Enough play. Back to work. Time goes. Watch this. Wash this equipment. I will go wash my truck and get some food. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. I can join the NBA. Right. Well, I'm already in the NBA. Never broke again. When you got the CD. <laughs> Alright, guys. Alright, I'm gonna take you all on my journey to wash this truck. So, stay tuned. Alright, guys, you. Just saw my awesome, my awesome basketball skills. Yeah, don't hate, don't hate on TG. <laughs> yeah, so now I'm gonna see if I can get this truck washed, even though it's raining, man. But, and I think that I saw the, the bay doors are closed or something, but I don't know. I'm gonna I'm still see. I'm gonna see if it's open. See if I can get it washed. You feel me? Yeah. But, Honestly, all right, one more thing I need, I need to let the guys know, man, you feel me? Remember, I went to a trucking school, right? In Tampa, he's called Roadmaster, you feel me? And <clears throat> out of my class, my class was one of the biggest class at that school, you feel me? It was over 20 odd students, you understand? And everyone that left, I was the third person to graduate, you feel me? I was supposed to be the first one to take the test from the entire class, but the day that the tests were scheduled for, I had an appointment. You feel me? I had an important appointment that I could not miss. So I had to go and take that appointment, and because of that, I had to take my test on the second day. You feel me? The two guys 
there were four students that took the test on the first day and three of them passed and one failed you feel me yeah um out of everybody that took that test in my class and got the cd and everything and, and went to companies to work and all that trust me i am i'm not gonna say i'm the only one that's still at the same company right now that they went to but a few guys from a class had reached out to me asking me how look guys see it's like um let me show you it's like the, the wash bay is closed i'm not really sure though i'm gonna go see though plus it looks like everything known is closed let me see. What time is it? It's just 4 30. I'm gonna try to see if I can put my name on my truck too. Uh, this is where it gets done. I'm gonna see what's going on, guys. But yeah, back to it. A few guys have reached out to me trying to get information about CFI and all of You feel me? They are not happy with their company because this, this is why, right? You know, honest to people, <clears throat> the amount that CFI pays per mile is not is not good is in my opinion it could be better you feel me it could be better what they pay the company drivers per mile it could be better you understand know, because see if i start your new drivers out fresh out of school at 35 cents per mile that's not really a lot you understand most almost every other company pays 40 cents and up per mile to the new drivers now this is the catch right this is the catch. Although CFI pays 35 cents per mile, right? You, the reason why you end up making more money than those other, comp that, 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 those other people driving for those other companies is because the amount of miles that CFI gives you. You understand? CFI always got loads. Always. You understand? Now, these companies is gonna offer you 45 cents, 50 cents per mile because they don't have the loads. So, if you're getting 40 cents a mile and I'm getting 35 cents, and you are only gonna get um, 2,500 miles, right? And I'm getting 3,000 miles. At the end of the week, we make the same amount of money. Even though you're making more money than me, you're getting paid more money than me per mile. Because I'm getting 500 miles more than you. So we get this, we end up making the same amount of money. You understand? Now, I can, I can almost guarantee you this. If you communicate well and you're not lazy, your paycheck won't be less than $900 a week at CFI. As a new driver. You feel me? As a rookie, extreme rookie. You understand? yeah and from the guys in my class who have reached out to me and stuff they are struggling to make 750 800 you understand and their company pay way more than what cfi pays you feel me so yeah as i said man i i don't want to be biased because i don't really have the 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 anything to really compare it to you feel me i have only um driven for for cfi only you understand fresh out of school straight to cfi nobody else you understand so i don't know but it's just something that's been on my mind man i'm, I'm like when i really look into it cfi is really a good company a good starter company you understand it's a good company to spend some years with you understand and build up you feel me save some money and buy your truck that way you can start making some real money. You understand? Yeah. Trust me, people. There's money out there to be made. You understand? It's a multi-billion dollar industry. You feel me? So, let's get a CDL, man. Start driving some trucks. I'm going to check on these people and see if they are they are washing trucks and all that. You feel me? And see what's going on. So, later. All right, guys. So, the wash bays are open. And so, let me go and get my truck washed. Damn, man. Oh, Lord. Put this back into the hole.
Oh dear man, it's <laughs> I don't know what people live live here man in this it's too it's too cold man. I can't sometimes I don't like Florida but <sighs> like now my wife have been considered moving moving to Georgia but man I can't stand the cold. Damn, man. Jamaica, come from. I can't take the cold. It's cool. yeah, too cool. All right, so pull into the wash bay. Get this truck wash. You see me? I have to be cruising below five mile power because I don't want my clock to get started. You feel me? So this is where we fuel to. You feel me? And CFI fuel is always cheap. So yeah, I'm gonna well no, I'm not gonna get fuel here because I got over half tank right now. And I'm not gonna run enough miles to really make back my fuel money, so Alright. Open sesame, you suckers. As I saw the wash bay closed, so I was like, yeah. I thought it was there was not working, you feel me? So Yeah. Yeah, gotta wash my truck. You feel me? These are the amenities you get at CFI man. You get the truck serviced and washed. Well, the company drivers get a truck service. I can only get a wash. You know, because CFI is not responsible for my servicing. Uh, it's all on me. Shut off engine, shut chop. Sparking brake. You wanna die, youth? You wanna die? <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna turn this engine off. Alright. Peace. Good bro, how are you? I'm hanging in there. Yeah. Kind of cold. Yeah, man. I saw like like it's about to snow or something, man. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> brush? No, I just wanted wash. That's it. Just a little wash. All right. So you don't want to brush? Just soap and spray off? Yeah, just soap and spray off is good. Yeah. That is raining anyways. All right. Yeah. All right. <sighs> All right, guys. So. Get this beast wash, then I'm gonna get one forward and go sleep. Alright guys, so check in with you guys later. So that's CFI terminal for y'all. Yep, peace.